seconds. Did I do that all right? Absolutely. Okay. Transitioned over. We still have a few minutes. Oh, okay. And I, also, I'm, I'm seeing... um, if anyone's not aware, this is Miss Scory. We do a two-hour score attack of any game. The I have picked them all so far, but it could really be anything. And, uh, yeah, the rules are... That's pretty much the rules. Two-hour score attack. There are, you know, some games have certain rules. I'll set the paste bin for this, which is... Um, but the big thing is that you can join late or you can leave early. So if anyone is interested after seeing a bit of the game and wants to see if they can win, feel free. Open open admission on the website, which I'm about like to. A, it's like a party that like you don't have to just you don't have to worry about saying goodbye to everybody at the party you can just leave if you want that's true that's you can very stay true. you can stay an unwelcome two hours or however long the party was okay where are we i mean i've definitely been a person who is stay at a party a lot longer than they should have and I paid the price. <laughs> you gotta pay the piper sometime. Always comes back. <laughs> uh, yes, okay. uh, it's, uh, yeah, it's nah. a... And I'm, not, I'm seeing Not safe for work story, so... I'll leave that to the imagination of everybody <laughs> else. But consequences were had. Now, I just don't go to parties. Yeah, I haven't been to a party in... I don't know. It depends what you define as a party. I think by some people's definition, I've never been to one. And we're off. Alright, so uh, what I'm seeing here is... Um, is that a duck and a chicken? Or are they both chickens? I think... I thought they were both chickens. Okay, so let's figure out who is not in the commentary. Zenek is not. Let's see if Zenek has clean audio. Roar. Not exactly. Uh, uh, I'm not that kind of person. Uh, but <laughs> I can say that I have been in a room <laughs> that turned into, uh, I, I didn't know where like you were going to go with it, and uh, I'm okay with where you went. Uh, so for this game, to talk about the details a little bit, now we've got Xenix audio, but it's pretty quiet. Let's see. Uh... We'll see. We'll try Rick Ray and see if we don't get people like talking in the back. So, uh, in the top right of this level it says clear a number right the way you clear tiles is by walking on at least two of the same color and then that builds up a combo and as soon as you step off of that color um another the uh, tiles will clear so you want to go for as many as possible Rickery is doing an interesting strat, which uh, involves not rotating the tiles. Um, so I think that there's uh, maybe a the bit of a disconnect there, unfortunately. The, the interesting strat of not knowing the full control scheme of the yeah. game yet. Well, I did write them, so I think that... Uh, you don't have... To, well, you have to finish stages in the sense that there isn't just an unlimited number of tiles. More do spawn in, but I don't think they spawn in, like, forever. And eventually, the tiles that are there aren't really going to make a very good Gee, combo yeah, for you. Really fast. Okay, so we are getting audio. We'll go with Zenic, even though his stream is way too quiet. Well, I see a timer at the bottom. Uh, is that just the generic time? Like, it starts at 1 and goes all the way end? Or do you get more time as you clear tiles? You get more time uh, as you clear some tiles, I believe. Let's see what I, uh, 
Why don't you, while I'm uh, telling Gregory that you can rotate tiles, <laughs> I'm, 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 I am gonna tell him. Uh, oh no, you left vague instructions for me. Uh, so. Oh, I did, I did. What I wanted you to do is pull up the <laughs> website, the paste bin that I posted, which has all the information there. Uh, because if I follow this link, because it's an OBS, it's gonna open in some weird limited OBS browser, and I, and it's gonna make things weird. All right. Um... Because, like I said, it has been. This would have been game three, so it's. And I did all this before the whole thing even started, so I. It's been. I mean, it's like two months since I've played this game. Um, I do own it, though. All right. Uh, so just just quick looking at uh, what you posted. Uh, so you clear the upper right moment of tiles. You move your chick to the life preserver to end the level. If the chick falls in the water, you lose a life. Uh, I don't see... So you... Obviously, a life indicator at the bottom. You probably get more lives depending on score. I'm guessing because I'm assuming there aren't going to be drops. Maybe like, there's not going to be a t there's not going to be a tile that's just like this tile gets you a one up. No, there aren't any power ups or anything. Um, mm. I, I don't think I've fully finished the game. I think well, no, I have. There's only ten levels. Um, I think we'll see characters finish the levels that are there um, and need to optimize their score you do get i think an end level bonus yeah it, uh, still continuing so you clear tiles by the same color 10 levels uh there are continues uh -oh. but if you use a continue you do lose your score yes uh so there's not really a reason to continue because i and, I, and then that, you say it in the rules that, yeah, you have to start from the beginning. You can't just continue from level three and move on. That's I actually basic mis oh. didn't have that. I had that the other way before, but then I was like, that doesn't... I feel like you should have to start from the beginning. So I changed that yesterday. Um, so Zenic got a pretty good green combo there. Um, and it's opting to finish the stage. And I'm pretty sure you get a time bonus. Let's take a look here. Stage clear. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, so you don't have to finish the stage. You do continually get faster, though. So you're at greater danger of um, falling mm -hmm. in the water, which is how you die. If you run into a tile, um, you don't just die. Yeah, I saw that the, the, the little chick bounced. So there might be a way where you could basically perma, like, trap the chick. Well, here's why you can't do that. Because oh, there's, a you there's two different ways to clear tiles. One is by making a combo and then stepping off to end the combo onto a different color. Another is after you run, after like a uh, tile is already part of a combo, it turns white. And if you take a U-turn on it, or it'll turn white, or if you just run over again, it clears immediately. So you can only go over a tile twice. Um, unless it's that com like it is at the very beginning where you're constantly stepping onto different sorts of colors. Um, oh, it's kind of an interesting way someone did that. They had like the pattern already set up and the chick just in the middle. And I saw on Zenix screen, you do get a, a few seconds of like, oh no, the chick's about to fall in the water. Yes, you do. You get a little bit of warning leaning like uh like in smash bros where you could just like infinitely almost fall off the stage although this this doesn't last quite as long yeah because in smash brothers it's permanent uh, until someone knocks you off <laughs> i thought i thought it w did uh end at some point maybe not okay so i think no, we see our first game over on stream so we're gonna get an actual score on the leaderboard here they got 10,500, which is... We already see Zanuck and someone are way, way above that. Um, some uh, Someone has a lot more lives. Technically, you could get a pretty good score and not lose any lives, or you could lose some. It, re it really just gives you extra chances. 
Mm -hmm. So see. Do do later stages get you more points then for doing combos or? They don't get you more points, but there are. Uh, you have to do more tiles. And like, I think you get, you have an opportunity to do a better combo because more tiles are constantly spawning in. Um, mm -hmm. But you do start faster. So it gets harder as you go on. Someone has been ending the stages. Like you can see Xenix been being much more efficient. He only just finished stage three and already has 69,100 points. And someone has 70,000, but just finished stage six. So yeah. I mean, someone's maybe just scoping out the levels in this first playthrough, just to see. I explain what you mean by backwalk strat, Exuno. Like, where you run over tiles that you've already run over and they clear right behind you. General, I mean, that can be a good thing, but it's also kind of weird because you have to, like, you have to expect it. It's easy, you could put yourself in a corner because you're going to lose tiles. So yeah, if you've r already run over a tile before as part of a combo or you take a U-turn on it, it turns white. And if it's white and you run over it one more time, it clears immediately. Um, I initially found this game because I was thinking of submitting it to Mystery Tournament, but I didn't think it fit very well. Uh, but it is a lot of fun. I like it at least. Uh-oh. <laughs> Rickery. The chicken will not decide that you wa it wants to turn sideways if it's just, like, better for you. That's important to keep in mind. Hmm. I mean, this game is kind of grim. You you do get a different amount of points for that because uh, it's not like most of the time you do it, it's not part of a combo. So you get a lot fewer points because you're not making a combo. You're clearing tiles one by one. Um, I like Rickery Strat right now of just watching the chicken go around in a circle. Probably they probably just stepped away for a second. But I guess, I guess in stage one, it just goes on forever. Yeah, if you set it up in this way where they're constantly changing colors on a path, I guess in that case you can trap them forever, but it's not very useful. Let's move, let's, uh, one of the nice things about this stream is we can constantly pop new people in. Get Jackazam in here, see what she's up to. Uh oh, not streaming. Maybe it hasn't started yet. Get Nico Jazz in here. <laughs> oh, we've got stretched. That's the strat right there. Vertically stretch. That's the it's the iPhone <laughs> strat. <laughs> yeah. The, Playing indeed. on my iPhone. And it looks like there's only three colors then. Oh no, four. Three. There's just three? Okay, I thought I saw four at one point. Maybe there are more in later levels. I don't remember that being the case though. I think there's just the three colors. So Xenic is setting up a pretty good combo here, but... So see, yeah, when these all clear, it's a mm -hmm. massive combo. So yeah, I'm pretty sure if you clear them all individually. You don't get the points like you do for combos. So you don't want to do that. But you can use it to get yourself out of a jam. A yeah, log I, jam. I saw, like, on Xenix, uh, with that giant red combo, could you, because if it's, it's all, like, shining bright because it's been walked on. Yeah. Uh, could you remove one of those pieces then Yes. Of an already walked on. Because, like, obviously you can't pick up pieces. You have to slide them. You can, and I'm almost sure that it still clears. So you can, um, 
You can sort so of walk through your own combo if you're fast enough at moving the pieces. Yeah, so that doesn't break the combo then, okay. No, it doesn't. Uh -oh. The longer you're on the same color, the faster your chick gets also. There's a lot of uh, situations where he speeds up. Um, there's also a go fast button. I guess that's the only control that we haven't gone over. There's not a lot of controls, despite this being a PlayStation game. Obviously, there's not a whole lot going on, because somehow I was able to, uh, when I, uh... Yeah, okay, so Zenik's doing that right now. Zenik has moved these combos out, and they're all just going to clear where they are. So once you've run over them, you can put them anywhere, which that really opens up a huge amount of possibilities about mm -hmm. uh, what you can do if you're fast. Yeah, because if you think you're trapped and you can't, like, continue the combo... I mean, Zenik already basically backed to the score that he had. Yeah, that's incredible. Oh, Mooware popping up 100,000. But Nico Jazz on 91,000 just hasn't died yet. Um, well, down to, down to their last life. Yeah. So, uh, so what I was going to say is somehow when I posted this, I just zipped it like I normally do for PlayStation games because it's been in queue and it was only <laughs> two megabytes. <laughs> so I just posted it on Discord <laughs> instead of needing to link. So I don't know why this game, <laughs> obviously there's not a whole lot going on if this game can be just two megabytes. I mean, but, 2000, uh, that's actually still kind of a late release for a PS1 game. It is. Jap Japan, I was, <laughs> the reason I said it weird is because I was going to say Japanese and I changed it. J Japan had a lot of budget late PlayStation games. They would just put out little stuff that you weren't meant to spend much money on. Um, and that was pretty typical for them. So there's a lot of really cool stuff. I, I, we have a lot of uh, MT subs that come that way. Also, this game is very loose. Oh, okay, nice. When it, I was looking at Xenic screen. When it comes to pushing blocks, like you can push blocks with other blocks, um, which in a lot of games you can't. Yeah, these, Jeez, these... Zenic is really... <laughs> These tiles are just coming in like chaos. Yeah, which is why you can't do this forever, because uh, things just get chaotic. But um, man, I was just I was enthralled. I couldn't even think. What I, what I was gonna say is because you can break the combo once you already have it going, I think that it's gonna take a while for people to get into the mindset. Like I recently played Pipe Dream for some reason. Giant Troop, I think. And there are a lot of games like this where you need to match up a path and you can't break it. But you, in this game, you can break it. It just has to have been a path at some point. Really, it never needs to be continuous if you're fast enough. Someone, unfortunately, wasn't able to clear oh. enough tiles. Still had one left to clear, so died there. Uh, I, more tiles won't spawn in, I don't think, until you uh, clear all the ones that initially start on the level. So the percentage of ones you need to clear goes up really high. But anyway, I think it's going to take players a while to get into the mindset of, uh, like, I don't have to actually keep this path here. I can break it as soon as the chick has run over a single tile, as long as I move the stuff around enough. And, like, you mentioned about, like, the going faster, like, as... As the, the little chick walks on, does the, does the chick have a name, or can we are we gonna name uh, him or her? Well, let me. See, I have the game. Or let them. me see. Let me get the manual. See what I can see. Uh, yeah, because it looks like you can choose between male or female chick. So I'm assuming that it might not have one. I don't know where I'm going with this thought. So, yeah, just because they... So, these games are interesting. They're from AI, or it, it could be A1. A1 games, and on the top of their 
covers. They put the genre of the game in big bold letters. <laughs> so on all, and they advertise their other games. So like at the top it says like bowling. It says sports, fighting, action, adventure. They have different colors for each like genre. <laughs> it's very. I don't know. They have a lot of genres. I don't know how many games these people published. Uh, but let's see. There is a story tab. Ooh, story tab. I said tab, but it's, this is a book. <laughs> this is a story page. <laughs> I've been using computers for too long. Okay, one day an egg fell from the sky, and out came a baby chick. The little chick had no idea how he got to the land of the moving tiles, but he knows one thing. He wants to go home. <laughs> Many dangers await the baby tic-tac chicken, and he surely needs your help in order to get past them. Can you guide the little fellow safely home? So his name is Tic-Tac Chicken. Tic-Tac Chicken, okay. Yeah. One thing's for sure, he doesn't want to be here anymore. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that much we know. Okay, I've who had the would? one OST sound on loop. Let's see if I can actually get someone's stream audio. Not in the race. Oh, most people are in the race. Everyone who's on I stream mean, now, but Zenic is too quiet. We're going back to looping the audio. I mean, I, I mentioned this. This seems cruel. It looks like you could probably just make the tiles go to the sand or the land to the side. I guess maybe in someone someone's screen, uh, that's just a bog. So like, not really, and Nico Jazz as well. And this is a kiddie pool. Muware is in a kiddie pool. Yeah. You could just make well, a platform to go outside it, of the It at pool. least looks like a kiddie pool to us mortals. It is the land of the moving tiles. We know that much. Guess... That's canon. All right, okay, here we go. Actual question about the mechanics of the game. We've got some actual so, stream audio. Yes, let's, let's hear it. So... Uh, you said that when you walk over, like, when you make a combo of colored tiles, uh, it makes the chick move faster. Uh, does that mean, like, if you only did, like, a combo of two, like, would it remain at that seat, or is it for every combo it goes faster? It slows down you... when you stop the combo. It, like, a combo of three, four, five, six, it continues to get faster, and then as soon as you stop the combo, it returns okay, back so to like... normal speed. Okay, so... So it's not like it's constantly like going faster and faster throughout. No, I think it does eventually. Like when the time runs out, I think you end up going a lot faster. Um, and then also the uh, like there's a go fast button, but like the the base speed of the levels is higher. So like. It's like Tetris, where if you started on level 8, your base <laughs> speed would be faster. You can still hold down to drop, but when you let go of down, yeah. it's just going to be faster in general. So there Nico Jazz did a little bit, but only moved like one or two tiles um, Yeah, okay. in so order to stop that, that combo. I can see that it, it did reset his speed. Yes. So like the interesting thing is going to be players willingness I think to just totally break the paths they have cuz they don't a lot of, now they're working around them but they really don't have to. Uh oh. Spin it spin it Nico Jazz. Oh, no. So you can rotate the tile when the chick is about to fall off and just send them back where they came from. You're going to lose the yeah, combo cuz all the tiles are going to clear individually but I mean it's better than losing. Mm -hmm. I mean, maybe it's not if you're trying to optimize your score, but it does add to survivability. Yeah, I, it feels like you want to maximize your score on the earlier levels. For sure. That, well, that seems to, I feel like that's the strat. The interesting thing is that, um, also I think if you go straight from one combo into another one, you, you get faster. Um, but I could be wrong. We're gonna have to see that. But an interesting, thing is that like pipe dream or something like that these players are saying okay i gotta build up this path real long before the chick even gets there so i'm set up but what that does in this game is it just gives you a bunch of tiles that 
like you've decided you can't move when really you could if you were fast enough move every tile individually just as quickly as it gets there and break everything behind it and you would be just as successful i mean that does that's hard you would want to set some stuff up ahead of time but um it makes you kind of rethink the sliding blocks tile games of which there are more <laughs> than you might think so like nico jazz is setting all this up ahead of time which is good but like right now yeah has decided that he can't go get that other blue but probably could have because he could have broken the blues that he already had just pushed them all out of the way Also, so like, you continually speed up, and then when you actually get the goal of the stage, you slow down again for a little while, so it gives you time to make a few more combos, but then you start speeding up again. Um, the, con the actual, like, detailed mechanics are actually pretty, like, they're not in the manual or anything. You just kind of have to figure them out, and I didn't put them all in the pace bin because I could have just, like, talked about specific situations for a long time. We have Zenic two hours. Pop Zenic popping a, a $140,000. Wow. For $1,000. <laughs> yeah, it's a, this is an expensive. These are, each one of these is a dollar uh, that so, goes to... Uh, saving chicks stuck in kiddie pool. Yeah, absolutely. Each one of these is a dollar that Shrambles has offered to graciously donate. Uh, untrue. Why are you saying Jackazam's on her way to a max out? Oh, because she hasn't posted? She started late. <laughs> I don't think so, but I... W w let's check in. She's already got 9999. Oh, let's watch an ad. What's it for? Uh... We're only we're watching it cropped. What's the story? What's the story? The oh, it's a Netflix. Netflix with Adobe for some reason. No, Jackazam's not on her way to a max, but does have a very high score. Um, I do not know what a max out for this game would be. There's a whole lot of room on the screen for a lot more numbers, so I I don't know if. We can go to a seventh, uh, so, like, earn. So if you clear stage 10, is that just, like, your score? Yes. Like, you can't... Okay. I believe so. That's similar to, uh, Tall Infinity, which was the first game in, in this story where mm -hmm. the game is actually, like, a limited length. So it's not just for score. You're meant to try and beat it, but then you gotta go for it. Um... And because everyone here is so good at video games, the trying to beat it part is only going to be the first, like, 30 minutes. Oh, okay. Unfortunately, Jackazam kind of... Oh, okay. Did a really interesting thing there. I don't know if you saw that. Had I broken uh... Had broken the combo, but then was able to save it in the middle because she, uh, like, broke the backwards track in the middle of while the chick was going. So, lost out, like, on the last few tiles of the combo, but then broke it early enough in the middle that could clear all the rest at once. That's some advanced strategy right there. And we're only... what? Uh, a f not About even a fourth of the way yeah, through? Yeah, not this. even quite a fourth of the way through. Um, yes, tomorrow at uh, Maurice, what time is it again? There's gonna be some Tetrising. Yeah, unfortunately, Jackazam's in a situation where, uh, even though you can move as many tiles as you want at once with another tile, uh, not if there's a wall. <laughs> like, you're still limited with the number of rows that the screen allows. Yeah, it's still stuck in that, uh, oh. yeah. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. So that that tipping animation only lasts so long. No, I did not hear what might be happening at three p.m. 
DST tomorrow. I know my Kuso match is at 5.45 EST tomorrow. It could be on MFH. Why don't you stream it, Maurice? Come on. Yeah, we're, we're looking good. Yeah. So... I think it is. It was organized. Anything is Mystery Funhouse content. Oh, oh, okay. I see what happened there. Muir tried to move a tile that had already been walked on, and then it just disappeared because he moved it. Oh. I'm going to have to see what the details are for that. Uh, Exuno, I know exactly what you're talking about. I will indeed tune in. And Tramble's actually, uh... Oh no, you missed that one. Trambles and, uh, and I and Exuno played a really fun game last week on Steam that uh, is unlike any other game. Oh, that Hopscotch game. Hopscotch played oh, it what? too. Oh, what's, what? Oh, is there gonna be another race of that tomorrow? Maybe not that exact one, but uh, maybe something like it. Gone. So Jackazam takes the lead, though. Yeah. He's got the highest score now. Just barely. Muware is right on her heels with the score. Actually, she techni uh, Muware technically has the lead now. Oh, yeah. Well, it was like but, as I was saying that sentence, it yeah. happened. Um, so Muware beats Stage 9. I don't know if we've seen a Stage 9 clear. Not on stream, at least. Um, yeah, Stage 10, you start with only a single blank spot. So it's pretty oh. frustrating to oh, finish it. Chick is stuck in space. This is be this this tile tile space. I'm trying to remember if I've actually finished stage ten. I don't think I have. Um, Muware is kind of I don't know. It's difficult to try and get a combo here. Because you have so little availability to move. Yeah, it looks like Moore is just trying to connect as many pieces as possible at this point. One if thing that our players haven't been doing is... Oh, and that's an unfortunate death. Yeah, so that's just a death, but that's okay. Quite a high score. I believe takes the lead now. One thing that... Oh, someone now. Look at that score. What happened? In the oh. lead. Uh... Uh, but a thing that players haven't been doing is setting up this kind of infinite loop like you have at the beginning of the stage. Um, which you could do. And then give yourself some time to think. <laughs> yeah, also the main menu song is... <laughs> like that nursery rhyme song. I'm, just, I'm trying to think of what song it is. <laughs> Oh, it's a Christmas song, isn't it? Yeah, we will yeah. <laughs> bring out some piggy pudding. It's piggy pudding, yeah. But, <laughs> but, but what song? That must be also another song. Because why would it be a Christmas song? <laughs> Moonware, get off the screen. We wish, <laughs> we wish you'd save our little chick, and now we're gonna cry. <laughs> Why didn't you save our little chick? And why don't you save our little chick? And why don't you save our little chick? And now he's pretty dead. Uh, Tic Tac Chicken. Why don't you save Tic Tac Chicken? Let's not forget. Tic Tac Chicken. I had to look. I did forget. I had to look in the manual again. I mean, I forgot what the place is called. It's like tile, tile zone. Oh, uh, the the land of moving tiles. The land of moving tiles. Uh, the interesting thing, I mean, that's not capitalized, but <laughs> this oh. this uh, whole manual has three pages of information that isn't like how to turn on your PlayStation. It's very limited. This is a very budget release. This does have this is a U.S. release though, um, which is fun. 
Apparently the Japanese name is something fun. Alright. We're getting you out of here, Moware. <laughs> You're not right. gonna play. <laughs> You're leaving. I'm Who else do we have? have? Let's let's see uh let's see how Xanax doing. What are the games this company has made? I know a, a bunch of the publisher games because they're advertised on the back. There's literally they're literally called tennis, bowling, billiards. These are also the people that made snowboarding, which is my favorite <laughs> PlayStation are those all, game. Those are name. all separate games. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. I mean, those are. I, that's literally the name of each individual game. Is just it's like a Magnavox Odyssey game or something that it's named just for what it is. I mean, I would have played a game that was called Tennis Billiards Bowling. Because I'd be curious what that would be. But yeah, we got someone now on stage 10 with, with an extra life. We'll see if okay. they actually complete stage 10. Yeah, someone uh, already is going to be getting the top score here. Oh, it's... Uh oh. Good save, good save. Yeah, it is, but it's... The problem is that you can't really clear... Oh, Jackazam got a little all tiles erased message. I wonder if you get a bonus for that, or if it just thinks, says a happy thing. Well, she has... Uh, almost... <laughs> she has a very high score. So I can assume that it probably does. Oh yeah. The score is almost only the on same stage as three. Wow. I did not know you could clear all tiles. That's how you get the high scores. Jackazam always finds the. Uh... Uh, that's that's the big points. Yeah. <laughs> as as we say around here. Here, let me get that on there. Oh, wrong, wrong one. <laughs> I mean, someone has some big points right now, too. Yeah, someone does have technically bigger points, but um, I don't think it'll last. Everyone gets big points. Sometimes when I'm uh, alone, I see if I can get all these three to be on the exact same cycle. I've done it before. But only when you're alone. Yeah, it's my proudest it's accomplishment. Well, it's not really interesting verify. enough to do if anyone else is in the room. <laughs> it's on I a mean, level of watching paint dry. There's competitions for that, I bet. Why did Jackazam break the combo there? Oh, is she trying to set up a... Uh... I assume she's just going for the full clears now. Yeah. Since that's where the points... Oh, and we do have a clear from someone. So we are getting the... Peep, peep. The end game lore. Peep, peep. Peep, peep. <laughs> oh, I am getting hungry. Oh, I forgot. I was cooking. Ah, ouch. Ouch. What? Okay, it's ready. Eat it all up. Yeah. No, they're eating chicken? What? They're eating chicken. <laughs> oh shit! No. This is, that's not good! No! <laughs> oh no! No! <laughs> oh no! Why would they do that? <laughs> I guess it's like a gag at the end of the game that you get a fun joke, but it's kind of, it's pretty morbid. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, Jackazam's still on stage three and has been successfully clearing all tiles. Yeah, I want to see how big this oh, thank you, Nico. bonus actually is going to be. Seeing as how she almost has 200,000 points, which is not even... Oh, she also oh. has a... Oh, she got a one-up from a, that. At 200k. 
Maybe every 100k is a one-up. Yeah. Someone nice. didn't even hit 175. So this is what I was saying. A player giving themselves more time by making the same shape mm -hmm. that they start with at the beginning here, which she has done. And now she's just setting up the combo so that she can clear the rest of the tiles. Yeah, once I see this combo, I think I will actually post in the Discord that there are a limited number of tiles. I think that in the later levels, clear all is gonna be pretty well impossible, but we'll see. Because they do start spawning in really, really fast. It looks like eventually they just stop spawning, which is something. Oh, jeez. No, turn it. Oh. oh. Still, you know, who cares? Look at the score. <laughs> just lose on stage three. No big, whatever. I can't believe Jack is going to max out the score again. <laughs> I don't think so. We'll see. I mean, if I would be happy if she did. We'll see, like, what if the counter doesn't go past 999,000? Like, there's clearly room there, but what if it's just not coded for that many numbers? I think that would still be an incredible score based on what we're seeing. So I would be, I'd be totally fine with a max out at that point. Um... I'm just posting PSA. Yeah, I think it just depends on how many points you get for a full clear. Yeah, I'm... Well, now I want to know because... And we can even we can even see on the right that there is she's only dot she's only done it once. Uh, do and we have Twin that. Galaxies? Can we look up if uh, Twin Galaxies <laughs> has a page for this uh, okay, that, that uh, isn't like the worst per <laughs> score that someone can put up like with Zoom? <laughs> all right. Uh, nope. Uh, when I searched Crossroad Crisis Twin Galaxies, I got Time Crisis Two. Hmm. So yeah, the all clear, even on stage three, is is clearly difficult. So I think well, getting nine hundred nine 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 thousand would still be like I if that maxes out, I'd be okay with it. Like from a game design perspective, I'd be okay mm -hmm. regardless. If they get a max, I'm happy. But I just mean like. If that's where it maxes out, it seems like that's a pretty well... <laughs> You'd have a hard time getting better than that, I think. The other I max mean, out, I don't feel that way. It all just depends on how many points it is. Because what if it is like... 100,000 points? Okay, Jackazam specifically made this to give herself time. Mm -hmm. Smart move. In the exact same spot that the original was. <laughs> I don't know if that really matters, but it is true. And uh, Someone's also doing that strat now. So someone has... I want to say it is 100,000. Because someone has... Oh, yeah. 149. So well, we're I, about I'm to see. We're about to see an all clear here. One up. Yeah, it's 100. Because someone now has the lead. Yep.
Yeah, I also didn't want to do this one too early. Oh. Oh, Jackazam was trying to die on purpose. For some reason. I'm not sure why. I think she just probably wanted to start over mm. or... I also Maybe didn't just... want to uh, do this one too early because this is a hard game to play for this long. I don't necessarily expect people to play it the whole time. Um, that's up to them if they think that they can improve. But, I mean, it is, you know, moving tile games can be a little stressful <laughs> because you're moving them so fast and furious. This is way better than Junction. I like it better than Time Ball. But Time Ball has a way cooler cover. I don't know if you've seen the cover of Time Ball, but it's one of the best video game covers out there. Yeah, at this point, it seems like the only strat to do is to do the all clear. While that's true, We've seen players barely even able to do it on stage three. So I think that just getting the all clear is a lot easier said than done. I think that on later levels, it might not be very possible for these players and like not for people that are like really good at this game, which, you know, we could discuss whether those people even have exist. had a chance to exist in this world <laughs> but oh oh someone oh i think someone not gonna clear that one. <laughs> oh, the blue didn't erase because it was a single tile of its own color that's so sad But yeah, at the very least, all clear on stage one is important. All clear on stage one seems doable for any decent player, which these players at this point are now. Honestly, someone could have had it on three. So I even the first three, I think, is doable. Oh, yeah. I think the first three is absolutely doable. Stage one, it's like, if you're not doing it, then it's a strategy failure probably not an execution one um i've seen it happen on stage two it I, I couldn't tell how much of a struggle it was i'll try and pay more attention but i don't even think we've seen it on stage three yet not that there's not time we, we almost saw it on stage three yeah it's true but see <laughs> those last few moves were desperate yeah they were just like i'd rather not fail okay is willing to give up the combo here which is good Jackazam is, I mean. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, spin it, okay. Okay, that'll do it. That's the that all clear. Oh my gosh. Maybe I'm wrong it's, about it just being just easy on stage one. This is intense. It just, it's so stressful every time just watching the the choreography of the blocks. Yeah. That's one of the really uh, things that I've, not the stress, but that I've enjoyed about this event is that it gives, these are games where there aren't really strats because we're picking stuff that is not popular enough for there to already be strats, except when we did Tetris. So, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, we did this, Tetris? When did we do Tetris? Giant Tetris we did. Uh, it oh, was week that Tetris. four something. I don't remember. But, uh... It's cool to see players just kind of come up with these ideas on the fly and theory craft. I think that's going to clear. Okay, yeah. So, the, oh, that's an all clear on stage four. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, when I posted on the Discord uh, that there is a bonus when you clear them, uh, someone just posted a smiley face. <laughs> Because they were like, yeah, there is a bonus. But yeah, if you get 100k for every all clear, there's no way that uh, well, it's just like, it tops no at 999. Like, there's no way it tops yeah. at 999,000. I feel like yeah. that would just be poor 
game design. I mean, it could be. We I don't know, but I don't know. I mean, unless they're is. assuming, like, the players cannot make that. Yeah, I guess that's fair. I mean, it's all of those uh, Sokoban designers who, who make puzzles who just don't think they're possible. Who else can we get here? Who's not? Rickery, Nico, Jazz, someone, and Jackazam in the voice chat. Who wear stopped? Which is fair. <laughs> the, the stress is real. I'll keep Zenic for now, even though the stream's so quiet. Oh. Oh, I wrote the. I accidentally erased the text and then clicked OK. Are we gonna get an ad yes. again? Search for stories. Yep. Yahoo. Oh, we know this is Netflix. Adobe Netflix. <laughs> Which, like, what does that even mean? You still got time, Cyro. This is a. Uh... Well, I mean, maybe. The actual runs of this game don't take that long. But you could be behind for strategy development reasons. Yeah, it looks like someone has got this game down now. Like oh, they well, are that's fair. smoothly putting their blocks together or tiles together. Yeah, really efficient. Um, oh, oh, did the oh. did the did the wrong spin. I posted a mechanic <laughs> in Discord, not the strategy. The strategy is far more intricate than just knowing that you can clear all the tiles. <laughs> Did, I feel like Zenic just allowed TikTok TikTok chick. Tick tack chick. Tick tack chicken. Tick tack chicken. Chicken, apparently, but we can say tick tack chick. That's that's just fine. I feel like that just sounds better. It does sound better. But obviously the developers weren't concerned with what sounds good. Um, I mean, even in today's standards, developers don't understand how to title their games. Bail in um, Wonderland. Well, what, what I'm saying is just because they were willing to put a very uncomfortable credit scene <laughs> in the game. So obviously <laughs> they're not so concerned with aesthetics. They've got their own uh, things that they need to show. I mean, it was a well-cooked chicken. I'll give them that. It did look good, yeah. Uh, us talking about food so much, it's like chicken is making me hungry, like, legitimately. <laughs> I don't want to so, eat like, this chicken. Tic Tac chicken, especially if Tic Tac chicken tastes like Tic Tacs. Not feeling that, but... Uh, I mean, I, I, I do like the, the Tic tac Uh It's actually the uh, character in Fire Emblem 7. Uh... <laughs> You're the tactician. <laughs> tic tactician. So what is a tic tactician? Are they someone who? It's a strategy. Is very like, yeah, like strategizes about how many tic tacs they're willing to share. Because okay, so oh. he, here's what I just realized. In addition to. You know, not it's unfor to leave you on a very suspenseful thought that's <laughs> very relevant. Oh, geez. No. One away. So is that you get to the point where you get an all clear on every stage, a point that I don't think we'll see, but that is a point that a player conceivably could get to. Then it's still doing that with combos is going to be significantly more points than doing it without. You know, if you do a bunch of two combos mm -hmm. to do it the whole time. Uh-oh. Oh no, okay, someone has more spawning in. I thought that that was the yeah. very end of their stage. If you only have one of one color that's spawning in, you're gonna need to U-turn on it in order to clear it if you only have one left of that color. Oh. Oh. 
<laughs> someone it, <laughs> was. It, did you see that? It like I, I did. Ate, it. it like ate the tile. I don't know what that's about. I guess there's <laughs> this game has some glitches too. I've seen that a few times. Like I feel like it happens a few times with some people. I guess it just happens if you switch when one's in the middle of uh, clearing. Okay, Xanax got an all clear. I uh, know. Oh, uh, he does not. Oh, I didn't realize that's that just, we were that's still. That's just round one. Round I should have looked at the of... number in the corner. Xanax not in the race chat, so may not uh, be aware. I mean, is not in like the tech, the voice chat. I did post it in the Discord, but you know, you don't have to read it. I mean, even in that continue screen, I don't think this chicken is drowning. Whoa, look at Spritz. What happened? Well, someone just came over, but ha now has the lead. Took it from Spritz. I just, I don't even know. Spritz was not on the board. Okay, so is it, is it not Spritz underscore T? Is it just Spritz T? No? Let me look up Spritz's stream for me. Why can't I find it? We had we had we had this issue last week. Yeah, that's what my wife just said too. Maybe maybe he's not stre streaming. Spritz is streaming on an alt. Uh, is it Spritz like S Spritz Q? <laughs> I don't know if there's any way for me to, like, find out. I guess I could check. I, I don't know if there's a way, because it's not, like, an SRL race. I know. So I can search for the person and see if they, it's linked. Nope, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, Hops does bring up a good point. Yeah, I could just do that. <laughs> <laughs> That's easy enough. But that does ruin the mystery of trying to figure it out. I know. For now, we'll get Nico Jazz in here, and I'll and I'll continue to loop the soundtrack. The single song. Somehow, there's a YouTube playlist of this game, but it's all just like ten second songs, and then the one real song. Yeah, I can't wait to change my stream name to add an extra M, just to throw people off. Trambles. Well, you kind of interpreted it as like a like a glottal stop. You didn't really say M for longer. You just kind of said less. Shramblems. <laughs> <laughs> didn't say where I was gonna put the M. That is true. Is this gonna be a final? Oh no. Okay, another one just spawned in. This is a really good combo. I don't know if I would have broken the green. I guess you speed up. I was talking on Jack Azam stream, by the way. I wasn't. Mm -hmm. Oh, someone. That's the first all clear. 119,000. Yes, yeah, so you get that points immediately. Oh, I just realized that the, like, if you spin the chicken, it does actually slow it down. In what way? So, like, 
Uh, on on Jackazam's stream, she spun the chicken and then had a little dizzy mark on its like around its head. Yeah. And it slowed down. Oh. Well, I guess if it's gonna be a cannibal, you can abuse it a little bit. <laughs> I mean, but is that Tic Tac Chicken's fault or is that Tic Tac Chicken's mother's fault? Now let's discuss this. Is the ow ooh ow oof that was in there, was that actually just taking the hot pan or was that them killing the chicken that they were about to eat? See, these are the questions. I mean, I feel like it was the chicken itself and not the mom because the mom had <laughs> oven mitts on. She had feather mitts on. That's true. And like, typically, I don't think she's cooking that chicken hot enough to have the oven mitts nullified. So I think our max score on the board right now with s someone's score mm -hmm. is with an all clear on stages one, two, four, and five. No, probably just I one, two, and four. I yeah, don't think. I think it's just one, two, and four. Yeah, and then a hundred thousand the... in combos. Yeah, because like the combos still get you a good chunk of points. Let's see if we can find any high score runs of this or any posting. Literally anyone in the whole world posting about a score that they got in this game on. Oh, so Cyro, yeah, you must you missed it. Uh, someone actually did clear the game uh, before they started doing the all clear strats. Uh, and at the end, the little cutscene plays. That's like, hey, we saved you, hooray! And the mom's like, I'm making dinner. And everyone's like, yay, hooray, dinner! Opens up an oven. All of the food is like hidden, and then we reveal that they're having like a baked chicken for dinner, which none of them bat an eye at, and it just ends. I can say that I played this for a couple hours without a break when I first found it. But I, that was more in a, a testing for MT context, and so I didn't go for score like this. I, I think, ID, another question. Is the chicken that we cook <laughs> one of the chickens that fell in the water that we didn't save? Who got it? Who went and got it back out? Who do you think is moving these tiles? Oh man, I don't know. That's a good question. We are. I guess we got it out. We're complicit. Yeah, we are just aiding in this horrible, horrible cycle. So someone is doing a smart thing right now and is saying, if I'm gonna put a color here, there has to be at least two. So we can get a combo. So we can, I can at least clear these. Um, so they're not desperate at the end trying to... Oh man, is he fast enough to get all of these? Oh! Uses... Pushes them in such a way where he can push both at the same time. What a clear. That's just smooth. There's not even any desperation there. Yeah. See, someone has this game down. Yeah. That's impressive. I think this I is. I think this is going to be uh, a better score than they have. They're already at three lives. I, I, I wouldn't be surprised if he hits six hundred. Is that your prediction? Here, let's do it. That, that is that is my hot prediction. Slash prediction. I will put a gifted will sub on someone, the line. Will someone three two five hit six hundred k? This run. Will, will you take the counter bet? 
I see. It's a mission period. Two minutes. Would you take the counter bet with a sub on the line? <laughs> with the with a gift sub on the line? Um, yeah. No, because I think he's going to do it. I, I thought he would do it, too. <laughs> <laughs> I had to think about it, but I was like, no, actually, I actually thought that that was going to happen. When you said that, I thought it was high, but I, I agreed with it. <laughs> I mean, it's essentially someone getting two more perfect clears. Ooh, some girl's taking the counter bet. Uh oh. Oh no. Okay. Someone very quickly was able to make the, the infinite loop. The loop could be. A bigger shape. It would be harder to make, but unfortunately, some girl, there are no steaks. Only fried. Only chicken. chicken. <laughs> Only cannibalistic, <laughs> horrifying chicken. So one thing that I'm noticing, someone is willing to sort of go for the best possible scenario, even if it's going to take, like, crazy tile movements. Um, I don't necessarily mean best score-wise, but if a tile is way out of reach, someone isn't saying, well, probably too far. Uh-oh. Oh, no. No, I... So he's... Nope, I don't think he has... No. Nope. Oh, okay. No. He could have done it. He what could've. he yeah, he couldn't have done it with those four-way tiles, ever. So that was what was hard, is that the tiles that he had to bounce off of had nowhere to bounce because you could walk over them in any direction. But with just the two uh, turns, he could have done it. Uh-oh, what is Nico Jazz doing? <laughs> Pause buffering? I'm not sure if that's a good strat. Someone was probably discussing pause buffering, so they were testing whether or not that was viable. Uh, in this game, looks like a no. Why does the chicken sometimes blink red? That's when he's like really fast. Oh, well, I, that might be actually when they're holding the triangle button. Oh, which, okay. Uh, which speeds them up. Sense. But now that we're seeing this all clear strat, I'm not sure how much use the triangle button has anymore. The fast um, food button. Okay. Nico's stream is getting weird. I might him out. Did Spritz ever tell me what his stream was? Is Rickery still playing? Rickery is still playing. And is in the voice chat. So knows the strat. Um, I think has just not been able to pull it off well yet. We got time. I mean, I think Rickery got it once, and it they might get it here. Oh, I just had the best idea for a Miss Gory game. I'm even going to send it to you on Discord just so you can react okay. to it and people can be hyped for a secret idea. <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, yeah, some, someone did get the stage four clear, so is only one complete clear away. I mean, if they did like the a, same scenario, I think that I think that would be really fun. It would be silly, yes. And I, there is a 
I weirdly enough have been watching a lot of videos about that. Oh, really? Like, cause sometimes like weird things get suggested to you. <laughs> it's true. I'd have to find and like so an obscure one. I probably wouldn't be able to use the one everyone thinks about, but um, I feel like in the nineties, there was a lot of stuff like that. But I definitely could see, uh, and I think it, at least I think the games are free to play now, I think. Mm. Maybe even just then a custom scenario, but then if you knew a lot about like what was the most efficient, mm -hmm. I, be I bet I could find a good way. Be hype people, this is a good idea. I think, and I think a lot of people have played this game as well. Yes. My goal with Miss Quarry at this point is just to try and find more games that are unlike the games that have previously been in it. Okay, Rickery destroying uh, his personal best right now. Did not go for an all clear on stage three. Um, but it's still going to come up with pretty high on the leaderboard. Oh, there someone just getting the all clear. There it is, 600k. There. Has it even been two minutes? It probably has. Uh, it's, it's been more than two minutes. It's been like six. How can but I? It was, it was close though at the at that one though. It didn't. Someone did save it. <laughs> nice. Sweet. Thank you, some girl, for gifting a sub to yeah. Bony Skelly Man. <laughs> That's a really good name. I don't know who Bony Skelly. There, I, I, I want to believe that there are like a ton of lurkers that we just don't know. I'm a big fan of that name, whoever you are. Can't believe Bony's alt got a sub. Good call. This graph is going to be something right now. Hold on, but before I show the graph... I guess we're, we're an hour in. A little bit more than an hour in. Yes, I usually show the graph about halfway through and give a little overview. So let's take a look. I need a big point sound effect. Like a soundboard. Like a disc boy, jockey boy, kind boy, of thing of someone being like, Big boy, 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 points or something like that. <laughs> so we have Wait, a very a big boy <laughs> you know um, the, the nice thing about the nice thing about this graph is that you could see right when the clear all strat was discovered you can see when the meta changed yeah Jackazam score shoots up has she still not cleared her I almost tried to Close the window. Oh yeah, Jackazam's still at 254. Oh no, but is it 408 now? I just wasn't luck walking. Been flying too close to the sun, but it's finally been able to match that. So yeah, you can see right when Jackazam's score shot up, how much higher it was than everyone else's at that point. And then uh, Spritz figured it out and went and then someone figured it out and also shot up. And now is this is gonna everyone's current scores are gonna be like off the chart. What are you saying? Jackazam score is better? Let's close this chart. Oh, efficiency wise? Yeah. Four hundred thousand on stage four means that she's gotten three all clears and good combos. I feel like you're going to get better combos later on just because you have more tiles you have to clear. Yeah, but you, you go so much faster. It's difficult, I think, to keep up combos in the all clear mm -hmm. stage. Is Jackazam um, just like only doing like one combo and putting the chick back in the loop? That time she did. I don't know if she's doing that consistently. The... What, what, from what I was seeing before, like, one good combo is, like, 
10, 15,000. If you get like a 11 or 12 combo, which is, seems to be as much as you can hope to get without really planning well. It's like 10,000. So, I mean, they are, that's good points. Especially when, I'm glad that people are pushing each other. And that one person didn't just discover the max out. Oh my gosh, someone, what strats? Oh, someone is gonna get another all clear. Uh... Did he plan? I feel like he doesn't know what he's doing here. Oh no, because they, no. yep. They're just, they're just, oh, okay. <laughs> tried to say, try to just go for the- Yeah, try to just go for the finish. Um, someone could have gotten another all clear, but- They could have, yeah. Um, seemed to be in a little bit of a panic mode. Which this game, if you're playing it, the way these people are, you're going to be constantly in a panic mode. This game is not for the faint of heart. Literally. If you have heart problems, avoid it. <laughs> I don't know why I just wanted to say, you know, stuck in a panini. <laughs> what? A little, pa little panic panini, you know? Oh, sure. Yeah, I, th I think that does need to be explained, though. I don't think anyone would get there on their own. They might. No. So like, this is a this is a weird thing. But like, anytime I've talked about the pandemic, I've always replaced pandemic with another like two or three syllable p word. Rick, we did it! Oh my gosh. Okay. Sorry, that was like incredible. No, like, no it planning. was very much more interesting than me having a terrible grasp on the English language. Okay, new and prediction. Messing with, it with my brain. Start prediction. Well, <laughs> it's funny that I'm only changing someone to anyone. <laughs> Will anyone hit 1M before. I'll just type 1 million. Why not? Before. Ah. Time is up. I put too many exclamation marks and question marks. Had to take it down so it didn't go over the 45 character limit. <laughs> you can't be that excited about this prediction. But this time I'm going to make it a five minute prediction. So you think no one will hit a million before the time is up? They have 45 minutes. I I honestly um, don't think they will. I I I won't like bet. I won't bet since I made the prediction and I want to be able to close it. But I think that uh, it's I mean, so hard. Like, it's hard to say. I think that because it's like it's one mistake. It's true. I mean, someone's at zero lives. I think all clears in these later levels are difficult. Oh my gosh, he got it here though. Yep. Seven, seven, six, four hundred. This is crazy. Maybe I shouldn't have made it five minutes. I mean, it <laughs> depends. Like, will will someone get another life at eight hundred? Yeah, we're gonna need to see two more all clears from someone to get a at, million. At minimum. Yes. I mean, I think he can. 30k yeah, I mean, while playing, I think will happen. In two levels, I think that'll happen. But I think that two all clear on what eight and nine, nine and ten, they can barely even finish ten. So I don't know. Even if the all clears don't get that much harder each stage, and I think they actually do. Even getting one, I don't think the players are at a part where it's like, yeah, I can get an all clear, no problem. Like, there are problems. They're making it's, it work. They're making it work hard, it's, but... It's the last, like, six, seven tiles that is what it comes down to. Well, there's a lot of opportunity for mistakes in the middle of it, too. If you keep a combo going like Rickery has, this chick is getting fast. This isn't even in the all clear stage, I guess. Stage, the later stages are just hard on their own. <laughs> I played this <laughs> when I first got this game. Uh, 
I had my little brother over and I was showing it, showing it to him. But it's like really stressful and hard. He's like, I don't play this baby game. He was like, he was like joking, but he's it's just funny. It's, it's like little kid game. He's like, oh no, the baby game is making me stressed. <laughs> you know, kids these days, 14 year olds collecting Game Boy Advance video, which he does do. Someone's got got um, the corner strats right now, and so does so does Jack is them. They they've got this, they've got their chick in the corner. Yeah. They 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 have done the exact opposite of what Dirty Dancing has taught them, and they have put baby in a corner. <laughs> I only know I've never actually seen Dirty. I feel like like is it worth watching? No. Okay. I mean like. I, I will say, honestly, I don't think there is any one movie that is worth watching. <laughs> you don't like movies? No, it's not that. I just I just don't think there are... I, I even would say this. I don't think there is a video game that you must play. Oh, but I'm not saying do I have to watch it. I'm saying would, it e would I even enjoy it if I had some time and chose to? I mean, yeah, you would probably enjoy it. It's... It's a basic 80s I think it's still 80s yeah I think so because it like it, it falls into that like you know Ferris Bueller Breakfast Club era of movies that they they all feel like they're in the same world oh 909 when is this prediction closing <laughs> <laughs> uh <laughs> You might have to refund everybody's points. <laughs> I won't. If they already predicted, it's fine. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, it's just one mistake. It's Someone is one mistake away from ruining it. Yeah, it looks like there's no more extends. Oh, no. I said it five minutes when I said it. I think that was at, like, an hour 15. It should be closing soon. Yeah, I, I'm seeing the little progress bar, and it's almost out. Oh, okay. So w when we saw a tile got, like, run over earlier, what it was is that as soon as the, like, expire animation starts, you can do it at that point. You can run over them, and they're not solid anymore. Mm -hmm. So that's why it looked like they were, like, getting eaten. Jagazam has some crazy strats. She needs to build a... a loop. But yeah, I just really like how this format lends itself to, uh... <laughs> the manually keeping the loop alive! I love it! <laughs> oh, that's so good. That's, that's good strats. Uh, I just really... Because, like, I, I didn't... I wouldn't have thought about this strategy at all about making the loop so, and doing the all clears and stuff, you know. Putting baby in a corner. Some of these games I am actually better at. Well, one of them so far, I'm actually better at than the people who have can played it for two hours, but most of these I'm just kind of finding and thinking that they're good ideas. Uh, someone, someone is not in a good position right now. They're basically just playing protection right now. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, no. I don't even understand what happened there. It moves so fast. Like anime. Moving faster anime than we can doesn't... even see. Anime doesn't move fast. It takes four episodes to do one thing. <laughs> it's true. Ah! Uh, I don't... I don't th believe... This is insane! What? <laughs> okay. I mean, it's still possible for someone to hit that million mark. No, absolutely. Will it, they will they want to continue? After they see someone's score posted? Let's take a look at that chart. First of all, let's get some big oh. points. 
And then Jackazam also coming in with a 600,600. <laughs> Let's get... Big boys! Big boys! I'll record that for next time. Honk, um, honk, honk. Honk, 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 honk. Or like on, uh, this is something, I don't know if people who aren't American will hear this, but like every radio station, regardless of genre, always has like these really annoying bumpers that say the name of the station. It doesn't matter what kind of station it is, but they'll be you're like, to, this is The Edge. Boom, The Edge. And they have like four people. The Edge. It's like a woman says it like all sexy for some reason. I, I, I don't know why they do this. The Edge isn't even a radio station I know of. I'm sure that is one somewhere in the country. You're listening to classical Beethoven 94.5. <laughs> Beethoven, Beethoven, Beethoven. <laughs> Maybe they don't do it with classical. I don't usually <laughs> listen to classical. I will say that they do it, you know, on like soft rock and like everything else. I guess they do, I listen to an NPR station. They don't do it on that, but it's a little different. I mean, and they always like they always have that one guy who sounds like he's definitely wearing a backwards baseball cap. Like, you're listening to whatever this radio station <laughs> yeah, it's, is. It's very edge. true. Like, okay, let's take a look at this chart. His baseball cap is backwards. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Oh, look how Jackazam submitted her score at the exact same time. Yeah, that I, I mentioned that. So you can't you can't even see that she had a score. It's it's almost like a, a bunch of like prairie dogs coming up. <laughs> and one of them is really weird <laughs> and tall and skinny. Each other. <laughs> oh, just come back just in time to see Rickery get the all clear. One of the one of the prairie dogs is a giraffe, secretly. I think among these three players on stream. Uh, this is an incredibly competitive match. Spritz, I have not seen post a score since uh, 394 or 392. So may not be playing anymore. Nico Jazz has improved and is probably still playing. Um, has obviously caught on to the all clear or else that would be an amazing score. I don't, right and back. I know Muwear's not playing, so we're we're down to pretty much these four. These three and Nico Jazz are the le are the competitors who are left. Ah, uh, ah, uh, okay. Here's what I will say. <laughs> Like what is this the next tile box up there? Super useless. Cause it falls in a random spot anyway. It's like who cares? I guess so you can know what colors are coming. But I, I just feel like there's you can't utilize that to your advantage in any usable way. Unlike Tetris. And I guess that helps you know when there aren't any more coming in. But you know that because they stop. So that's another way to look at that. Rickery is having an adventure. This is insane. Yeah, that's not happening. It looks like if you're on the same tile for long enough, the uh, teeter animation, like it won't keep playing every side you go to. Eventually, you just gotta call it and move on to a different tile. Game gets impatient with you. Jackazam being very methodical about this one. This is gonna be a massive combo. I guess it's not gonna be that big. It's pretty big, though. Probably like. Well, I'm trying to estimate it.
An another thing I really like about this game is that you can move the finish. It's very loose in that way. I think Jackazam is trying to do an all clear here without making a loop, yeah. It's pretty difficult. Uh oh. Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow. Okay, I'm back. Did someone break a million? No, but Jackazam just got a really good. She was able to do an all clear without making a loop. Um, was just oh, kind of wow. methodical and kept it going out the whole time. So, um, I, I not that that played. actually like will get you more points, but it was cool to mm -hmm. see. Got two so very we... large combos in the like twelve or thirteen. I know we discussed this. We probably already know that the counter will probably go above one million. But boy, would I laugh if when we get to that point where we almost get a million and it caps at nine 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 nine. Yeah, that would be a pretty funny prediction. Like rest in peace, everyone who predicted yes. <laughs> yeah, turns out it was impossible. Gotcha. Uh, I would love to see that. To get a million. You're going to need to get a perfect clear on eight stages, I think, at minimum. I think you could probably get 200,000 in eight stages of playing. But mm -hmm. you might need nine stages. I think you would need nine. For s Actually, I think you'd probably only need eight. Still. Perfect clear in eight stages? It's a tall order. Maybe nine? It is. Even a taller order. Well, I'm really short. The, I would know. You also get the benefit of... Because, like, when you do lose a life, you still retain the score that you got in that level. So you could just, like, build up a bunch of extra points... And then do it again just to get the per just get to just to get the all clear. Oh, like use your lives, you're saying? Yeah, use your lives to get more points on an easier level. Somehow I was spacing out for a second, even though this is the only thing I'm doing. I was looking at the gameplay, but it was just like everything was closed it's, off around me. It is kind of mesmerizing. It is. Um, yeah, well, I think that's going to end up happening accidentally because the later levels are so hard. Mm -hmm. And But it's true. You could do it on purpose. If you are somehow, you've gotten all perfect clears and you're on stage 10, you should die a couple times right at the end. Which is, I think, the first instance we've seen in Miss Scory of, like, stupid score strats. Oh, my gosh. Oh! Wow, Rickery made it happen. Oh, uh, wow. Like, that deer is just so happy in the background. So, he has 474 and just finished stage four. Do you think that that's four all clears? I, yes, because it says uh, on the side, uh, all erased four. Oh. <laughs> Did you not notice that? No, I didn't. Oh no. That's so I stupid that that was there the whole time. Uh, I mean, that definitely implied that you could do an all clear. I know. That would have, uh, yeah, it would have. You know, I just think if they're not going to put it in the manual, you know, why do I have I to mean, figure out the rules? I, I bought this game just so I could know them. That's I mean, not the why. Game never, I bought it because I The game it. never tells you that the chicken's name is Tic Tac Chicken. Right. And because the manual is supposed to have more information than the game itself. It's supposed to uh, let make you glean things, you know? It's like, oh, I don't know. But now that I've looked in the manual, I know. Well, we know that in this game it glazes them because we saw the ending. That's true. 
I was gonna say, I don't know if Rickery can get the all clear, but I was confused about where they were in the stage. They've only just spawned in the inner tube. Life preserver. Yeah, because is it, is it... I mean, I've been watching this game for now for an hour and a half. Yeah. Does it only give you one round of, like, refill tiles? Yes. Like, when the... Okay, yes. so it's not like it will give you a second refill round. No, you can... The, the, uh, the stages are in two distinct... Um, rounds, I guess. Like, first, clear this amount, and then second... Get clear your, everything. Get, get Tic Tac Chicken to the life preserver. Yeah. Which, if you're sort of naively just playing, second round maybe isn't going to be that long. But since we're playing for score... Oh. Uh, oh. Oh. Nice. Oh my gosh. I can't believe Rickery I... pulled that off. I was concerned for a moment there. Yeah, that's incredible. I think they're really starting to feel the game. Like, where it's be becoming, like, somewhat second nature, what it is that needs to happen. I love it's that it stayed competitive this long, though. I'm actually surprised it's been 90 minutes. I feel like it's been kind of flying by. Maybe that's just me. Yeah. I, I, this, this game is, it's one of those things, I think, Someone mentioned it in the chat. Like, this is a game that, like, you could see yourself playing for hours without realizing. <laughs> yeah. I think, um, I think this would be fun, oh. uh, competitive scene. Obviously, that would absolutely never happen, but I think it would be fun. I can't wait for, uh, Crossroad Crisis Season 2. Yeah, Crossroad Crisis Esports, sponsored by, Red uh, Bull. Tyson. Oh, Tyson? <laughs> I know, I was going to say Red Bull, but I was like, oh, no. Sponsored by Popeyes. <laughs> it would Popeyes. be a chicken company. Yeah, sponsored by Popeyes. I don't think we have any Popeyes, do we? I, I, I think in this area of the country that I'm in, the Pacific Northwest, there are no Popeyes. Um, at least not in my area. So I've never been to a Popeyes, but... For well, some reason, they do all, play the commercials. Almost all of like the the KFCs in my area turned into Popeyes. Oh, there's some KFC around here, although I've hardly been to those either. I think if someone beats their score, it's going to be over a million. Yeah, I, I would agree with that. I don't think we're going to see a higher 900,000. Maybe we will, but I guess I'm just hoping that doesn't happen because that's that's no fun. I mean, Rickery, though, gets another one, is now at 70,000. 700, even. That's, that's what I meant. <laughs> Add another zero to my words. 700,000. On stage. And now they're going Just on now going seven. on to seven. So... With the way Rickery has been playing, um, gonna need nine all clears to break a million. More um, than you, likely, yes. Yeah. Wow, Jackazam ending with a big combo. That's crazy. <laughs> wow. She is almost at 600 entering stage five. Yeah, you can tell the difference in efficiency with Rickery's score and Jackazam's score. So Jackazam could easily only get eight all clears and break a million here if she continues playing like this. Which weirdly, Jackazam's strategy is riskier though. Yeah, it is. Although, if you watch Rickery's thing ever... I mean, like... It's, it's not like Rickery like... is really playing safely. I think he's just kind of playing desperately. And it's working out because he's fast at reacting to what's going on. But there's less planning involved, I think. What the heck? What's going on here? Like, Rickery is... Like... I have no idea what Rickery's doing. I mean, it's but it's working. That's crazy. I mean, it's just like... Rickery mine is, is working on a different combos. level here. 
is what, doing small what? combos to keep like the chicken from going too fast. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I mean, what the hell is happening? This is crazy. And I think Rickery is abusing the fact that you can walk on tiles twice. Yes. To give themselves a little more time to like set up their next move. Well, that also clears them, which is good for clearing out single ones. No, I really do, it really does seem like Rickery's brain is, is in the matrix here. This is like, because everything Jackazam is doing on stream is impressive, but I also like, I get where she's coming from. Um, a lot of these strats are so like big brain. Oh, so this is impossible. No yeah, all clear Rickery, here. When you have yeah. two single colors, you can't possibly bump on the final one. So I think Rickery uh, acknowledged that, but that that might ruin the chance at getting the the million. Yeah, Rickery on that entire stage, only two tiles from clearing got 13,000 points. Which is like not a lot. That is nothing. So I think that um Jackazam's strategy might be pretty important playing efficiently like this. If she plays well, she could easily break a million. I just it it's these later stages that really the stage themselves is challenging, so saying, oh yeah, you also have to play really good and get a bunch of combos and get an all clear is asking a lot. Ah, okay. Wow. Oh, okay. I see what yeah. Jack Zim's strategy is. Partially, I think, because the strategy exists. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh! 7 <laughs> <laughs> 11 beating stage 5. Meanwhile, Rickery is at 7 21 beating stage 8. I guess could be it. Uh, yeah. somewhere closer to like, 820 see, something. See, that was the riskiness. But like, she she sets up her strategy to make yes. it so there's only one color left. Um, Rickery, by doing that, like, the multi-walk that he's doing right now, it destroys all combos because they each clear individually. Um, mm -hmm. So yeah, the extra time is good. The points go out the window. But I mean, if you're only going for the the final clear. Yeah, which I think is uh, a somewhat valid strategy at this point. Although you are going to have to plan what colors you have left. Um, Rickery's done quite a good job here. Gets the all clear, yep, and... no problem. Mm -hmm. Able to do it in a normal way. <laughs> and not the uh, duck <laughs> duck feet underwater way. Yeah, yeah not, not the way in which... Even people fully focused on it are unable to understand what's happening. Oh, Jagzam's the one with the crazy strats right now. Oh, is just clearing oh. the stage. She she decides to just go for the ending. I don't know if it's because she was already so close or just. I think she she may have panicked. I mean, and it's, like, it was too late. If you're maybe. ever going to panic in any game, this is it. But with how Jackazam sets up her combos, she might be able to just only need two. Two more stage clears to get the million. Yeah, Rickery is just deciding every time I'm just going to try and do my combo twice. Just for the time. And it's honestly Rickery, not that bad of a strategy. Rickery has the space to be risky. Rickery has two additional lives. This is crazy. This is probably the most uh, tense that any of these has been at the end. The final 15, we're, we're really pushing it here. 
I mean, and all you million believers. Yeah, we could see it. We could see an inefficient a million uh, from Rick Ree or an efficient million from Jackazam. I mean, and even someone has a pretty good score heading into stage six. So oh, yeah, heading into also... stage six. This is a pretty good score. I was thinking the end of stage six, that's not so good, but um, that he had missed one. Wow, Rick Ree gets the all clear again. Yep. Nine four one, but finish <sighs> has to get sixty k on the final stage. Will not do that with an all clear, especially without an all clear, especially the way Rick Ree plays. Yeah, Rick Ree will need to like all clear the final stage, and then we will get blessed with the cutscene again. Yeah, what is Jackazam up to here? Okay, just finishing the first phase, I see. Yeah, because the that, that life preserver spawns in a little before. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Jackazam! <laughs> I'm not, like, blaming her. I mean, she's doing what she can. It's just, like, crazy. Oh, that's it. That's yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Rickery still has two lives. I I don't think Jackazam has enough time to, to do another run. You're probably right. Like if if it was like 140 maybe. Gosh, I think Rickery's gonna get a million. He still has two lives. Like Rickery could just farm points with those two additional lives. Jackazam could farm points. I don't know if Rickery really knows how to play this game in a way where he's getting big combos all the time. Because he needs that extra time with the way he's just like reacting to things. The double uh, path. Yeah, specifically saying, I don't want to get this comp so I can have more time. Which, at this point, um, with the way this event works, I think is the way to go. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay. Moved it too early, got too ahead of himself. He actually had it there to bounce off mm -hmm. and go the other way. But, um... Got, got a few more points, though. <laughs> Wow. I don't. Rickery doesn't employ the the square strat though, does he? No. He just does all of his lines twice, and that's how he gets the extra time that the square affords you. I think he's done it before, but, like, hasn't been recently. Yeah, Jackazam has said that she is done. Uh-oh. Can... He can't do it. No, I... Uh, oh. That was, oh. That was just oh. the first, first round. Yeah. Whoops. <laughs> Has plenty of time. Plenty of time. I was just thinking because he was on the stage for so long. It's because he... Um, it's probably one of their other games that they have, like bowling or billiards. Yeah. Or right, right now, we're just listening to the only song from the soundtrack on loop because... Um, or puzzle. Because all these people were in the race chat. This is so tense. <laughs> nice, thanks for the raid, Jackson. Oh. Oh. I don't know why. Oh, I... he's got a. He's got a bounce. 
What? Nope. 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 Okay. Still has another life though. Still One has more another try. life. Oh my gosh. Like, has to get has to get it here. Someone is having trouble with these later levels. Um so I don't think I don't think someone's gonna get I don't think someone has enough time or the lives. I think he has there. time, but he he lost lives, yeah. I think that Um I don't think it's happening. I think he just barely has time. It's not like Hello. Hello. Hey, how's it going? It's going well. This game was really cute and fun. So thanks for this. Of course. Uh, I mean, it's really, it's uh, really tense. So. Oh yeah. I so got, I don't know if you. At the end, I can't even play anymore. Yeah, I don't know if you know about Rickery's score right now, um, but has the potential to get a million. Uh, oh nice. So what Rickery is doing is playing really inefficiently and is basically <laughs> only getting all clears and is basically like every combo he's doing twice on purpose yeah for the extra time yeah he was talking about that in the uh voice chat um oh, looks like it's we're and, and not making the loop like you were yeah I, I like the loop but getting out of the loop is uh a bit rough in the higher stages <laughs> Yeah, I mean, this uh, is probably the most intense end oh. misquarry we've had so far. This is crazy. Yeah, it's a fungi, oh. but it's like, for how cute it is, it is stressful. I, I it know! It is a very stressful game to play. <laughs> I know it is. I, was, I didn't think anyone was going to be in this for the long haul. I'm glad it got so competitive. Yeah, I... I was tempted to go for oh, no, no, no. Run, Rickery, Rickery. my oh! my brain can't handle it. Oh! <laughs> no! Oh. <laughs> oh no! Does win, most likely. So yeah, we had a prediction on whether anyone would get a million. Um. So we still don't know if the score maxes. I think I think you can redeem that point. I mean, like oh. maybe maybe yeah, give yeah, it another yeah. ten minutes because we never know. Maybe someone who isn't on our featured stream right now. Well, these are the only three still playing. I think. Oh, and there's then, only three left. Okay. Yeah, Nico Jazz. I pulled up his stream. It's nothing. Um, I, I think that we're. I think and I doubt these people it. are going to play again. Unless someone finds the ten-minute hack. <laughs> Wow, it was really close on the bet. It was that stage seven that I think did Rick Rian. If they if they were able to get it there, I think they should have sacrificed one of their lives on that stage instead of going for the clear. Maurice, want to come in here and plug it yourself? I think we're done. <laughs> I could plug it, but you'll give it better justice than I will. Man, that was that was really good. Um, it was a lot of fun to see the strategy develop over. This reminded me a little bit of Zoom in that the strategy became so different at the end than it was at the beginning, um, but also was a lot less broken than Zoom. <laughs> hey. Hello, hello. Tell us what's going on. Yeah, so we decided that we like NES Tetris suddenly, so tomorrow we're having like a an amateur Tetris tournament. It's gonna be exciting. We have we have all the mystery people. We've got Boney and Jackazam and Rickry and Freeball. It'll be great. Mitz will be commentating. Oh nice. I'll be doing it. You you will be what? I'll I'll compete. I mean I probably won't do well, but I will compete. Oh you'll compete? Oh Yeah. I'll have to adjust my bracket then. Sure. The, the more the merrier. <laughs> How about you, Shrambles? Peer pressure. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'll give a rain check on it for now. Yeah, but it go does sound fire up. Fun. Yeah, go fire up Tetris. Like level, we're gonna start on level nine. So if you can get like one hundred or two hundred thousand on level nine, that should be enough. I'll have to see. I. I uh... 
Yeah, I've, and that's at what time tomorrow? It's going to be at noon EST. I, I'm not sure if it's going to be on the Mystery Funhouse channel because it's not really Mystery Funhouse content. Maybe I will ask Goro, otherwise I'll just restream it on mine. Okay. Yeah, I think uh I think we could probably put it here. We got we got all the right people. Hmm. But we'll see, yeah, we'll see uh that would ultimately probably be up to Roar, but we'll ask him. And uh yeah, that's awesome. I'm looking forward to that. That's a, that's another score another score-based thing that you get a Oh yeah, that's true. See. It's 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 fitting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, so on a, so a score attack, you know? Congratulations. So Jack is am. Congrats, Rickery. I, I wrote contrats. Contrats. It's a it's a chicken eat chicken world out there. Telling him that he didn't get to see the cannibalism at the end. Did you ever get a clear, Jack is am? Uh no, I did not. So at the end, there is a scene where your mom bakes something, takes it out of the oven, and it's a big roast chicken, and then all your all the chicks eat it. What? Yeah, I know. That's not okay. Yeah, I didn't know that happened until uh, I mean, not that I probably would have, I wouldn't have like said it can't be on the show or anything, but uh, someone did get it clear early on, and we uh, we got to see that. Nice. Yeah, I got a decent first attempt, and in my second attempt, I think was when I figured out about the all clear points. So I stopped going for clearing stages and just going for all clears. Well, you say that, but you could. So the way Rickery was playing, it would have taken nine all clears to. Uh, to get uh, uh but you could have done it with eight with if you had continued at that same pace to get a million so it i mean it just got way too hard at the end though yeah it's even, so fast you have no time to react to anything even though you said that you were focusing only on the clears you were still getting pretty big combos like there was one time that rickery made it to the very end of a stage and couldn't get the clear and had only gotten on the whole stage 13,000 points so, because you were you were actually clearing your combos instead of walking them backwards for the extra time. Um, yeah, that's that's true. The the extra time looked like it helped a lot, though. It did. I mean, R Rickery's uh, at one point, Marie said in chat said Rickery's brain is in the game, <laughs> and I like <laughs> it was it was crazy. We were watching and just like could not even parse the strategy, but it worked. Um, but yeah, this was a lot of fun. Um, it actually. I was concerned about playing this for as long, for two hours. I thought that people were going to get bored, but uh, that did not happen. We didn't quite make it two hours. Almost there. Well, Rickery, when we had that prediction, it wasn't just you that could have done it. So they were betting on all three of them. So you're not the only one that needs to apologize. <laughs> oh, do I need to apologize? Sorry. That's only if you feel tried. that you need to. I don't think you owe them an apology, but who knows? Um. <laughs> yeah, the, uh, man, it was a lot of fun. A lot of fun watching. Um, I think we're going to end this stream a little early because no one's playing anymore. But uh, <laughs> let's see that chart. Oh, yes. Let's take some time to look at the chart. Let's look at those. So yeah, you, you can see uh, Rickery's score just edging out someone at the end. Yeah, that's crazy. Also, if you look at um, about 1645, you can see that's when things started to change. Jackazam, mm -hmm. I think you were the first to post a score that has any all clears in it, and it just shoots up over everyone else, and then things started yeah. going crazy. It was a good competition from uh, everyone at the end. Yeah, it was really close in the beginning and really close at the end, and yeah. it was a lot of fun. Yeah, I uh, I really liked this one. I have a much more convoluted idea for next week, so let's. I'm gonna see if we can make it happen. Nice. Um, 
but I think it's going to be a really good one if we can make it happen. Uh, so tune into that. It's going to be very different than this, although I also love games like this, Rick Ree, and I could fill this whole thing with games like this, but the problem is that not everyone shares that opinion and are more interested in doing varied ones. And then if we didn't do varied ones, we wouldn't have had fishing, which was just a great fun. Um, so yeah, thanks everyone for joining us. Uh, uh, check out either this stream or Maurice's stream, we'll figure it out. But if you want to join, uh, get on our Discord and play in a little small amateur NES Tetris tournament tomorrow. And uh, yeah, good to see everyone. Uh, thanks for coming by. Thank you so much for commentary shrambles. It was a lot of fun. I think and, for having uh, I don't know if we know still whether or not you know that meal at the end of the game is justified but it's just one of life's great questions I guess we, yeah uh, did, what came first the chicken eating itself or the egg <laughs> eating itself? yeah what came first the chicken or the roast chicken <laughs> <laughs> the chicken or the roast all right we'll uh, leave that we'll leave that question for you chat to ponder yeah. and on until that next note time. Uh, if you have time Look up, you know, Rankin Bass, who made, like, Santa Claus is Coming to Town claymation specials and stuff. They made one for the Easter Bunny, and they have a song in it about what came first, the chicken or the egg, and it's one of the most annoying songs in the world. So uh, everyone should look that up. Uh, and, yeah, do so. And I'll leave you with that so you can uh, get in a really annoying song stuck in Anyways, goodbye, everyone.